uh, when it comes to public transportation, um, we know that many countries are suffering from overcrowded roads, uh, um, uh, be it in public transportation or in private cars or motorbikes or tuk-tuks or whatever it might be. Uh, uh, and also to, uh, to create and, and foster a, a safe environment for people that they feel safe in taking the bus, that they feel that they get safely there and on time. And, and that's also, we have experiences to share. And, and we feel that there is a lot that we can learn uh, from you and you can learn from us when it comes to that. Uh, so, so we talked about th those areas. We talked about um, finding smooth transport solutions. Uh, uh, you are uh, building a very impressive uh, metro system in Cairo, uh, uh, but there are also other ways to, to cater to the transport needs. For example, there could be the bus rapid trans transit systems for, for buses. Uh, there could be measures, uh, speed cameras that could also reduce the speed. There could be this kind of central barriers in the middle of the roads replacing crossings by roundabouts to reduce speed. And then, of course, and, and uh, there I I'm, was so happy to discuss with my Egyptian counterparts and friends, also the importance of, of uh, education, working with children, working with families, uh, realizing the dangers, realizing what can be done to reduce the risks for people. And, and for me, traffic and road sa uh, safety and, and uh, it's not only for me, it's for my Egyptian counterparts the same. It's a sign of, um, of caring about people. Uh, and it's something that where everyone feels that this is important to them. Yes. If you talk about some other sector, some people will say, yeah, this is good, f important for me, but maybe some else people, other people would say, no, it's not so relevant for me. But traffic and road safety, if you go to school in the morning, if you go to your work in, in, uh, during the day, if you go and visit your relative somewhere, we all depend on, on transportation. And it's not something that will go away. Um, so if we, together with Egypt, uh, um, can share some of our experiences, we have all made mistakes. We also made mistakes sometimes. But by learning from our mistakes and our successes, uh, we hope that we can bring something new to Egypt. And people are very responsive to this. I feel a very positive response, a very strong engagement. Uh, I feel it politically, I feel it from businesses, I feel it from, from the governorates. This is something that really strikes a chord with people. And, and uh, I think it strikes a chord with, with uh, normal uh, Egyptians also.